digital transformation must be accompanied by physical transformation if Grenada and other OECS member states are to realize true growth in the legal system. That's according to Attorney General and Legal Affairs Minister, Senator the Honorable Claudette Joseph. Speaking at Tuesday's ceremonial opening of Law Year 2023, Senator Joseph says Grenada supports and is moving towards establishing a fully digital operation to promote timely and efficient delivery of justice. In 2021, Grenada launched the e-litigation portal, which provides court users and all stakeholders access to assigned services anytime, anywhere, and on any device. We at the government level are encouraging practitioners to move all live matters onto the e-litigation portal and the, the rules allow for this to be done um, by consent of the parties because we are moving to a fully digitized um, operation. We are going to be digitizing our, our records in the court system. We have identified digital and physical transformation as key components in the efforts to move our country forward. In this regard, a policy direction has been issued applicable across all governments, government departments that allows for printing of no more than five pages at a time. The Attorney General explained that having proper facilities and accommodation also assist in fulfilling the mandate of the courts to provide a fair, resilient justice system. She spoke of government's plans to construct a state-of-the-art Hall of Justice in 2024. The member states and territories are focused on providing enhanced facilities for the judiciary. In Grenada, construction of a new state-of-the-art Hall of Justice that will incorporate environmentally friendly and renewable energy technologies is scheduled to begin in early 2024 as we use the rest of this year to complete all preliminary works. I know other jurisdictions, for example St. Lucia, are preparing for similar projects. A number of activities were held locally to commemorate the day, among them a church service at the cathedral, the inspection of the guard, and a special virtual sitting. Bishop Clyde Harvey encouraged legal practitioners to exercise wisdom and fairness at all times, which reflect positively on the entire legal system. Navigating these changing tides require wisdom and humility, courage, and a deep love for the people of our islands. Grenadian lawyers, Caribbean men and women, all I can do is invite you to rise to the challenge, to ride and conquer the changing tides. Amen.